ETH, we start with one hour chart. Okay, first of all, if you refer to our analysis, when the price was here, you mentioned we're looking for sell. That's why I want to give an update since we have a trade. Okay, that's why when the price was here, we mentioned we can expect the price to drop and at least the price tag the trend line before we get there. It may, I mean, before we look for buy because we mentioned we're expecting the price to drop and this is what we get. Okay, and there was another second opportunity and no, anyone is in the trade, whether from here or there, because I didn't have the update for this. Okay, when the price was here, I give update. I was we were, that we were, I mentioned we are looking for sell, down move. Anyway, anyone in the trade, if they want to keep the trade, at least move their sub loss or book some profit. Or if they take the, if they take the profit, okay, then we have to look for second of a next opportunity. No one to see how we can trade it. Okay, the only thing is whether this one can give us one more drop or not. Okay, but from what we have right now. I think if this one may become a deeper correction similar to what we have here, maybe we can look for the expand another flat for one more drop for continuation. By the way, we start with higher time frame daily chart. You want to see what we have based on daily chart? Okay, right now this is what we're looking for. Whether this is a correction and how complex can be before we get the next move. Okay, and uh, in this case we move to lower time frame. We have nothing so forward chart. All right, one thing, one of the reasons. When the price was here, you mentioned to me we get the down move, and this is what we get. Because if you put this one in relative to this, we simply we can see that all the indicators showing us the divergence. Okay, that's why we're expecting the price to drop. Now we want to see, as we can see, the price also broke the trend line. We are not going to adjust the trend line because we mentioned it's indicative. We are not using that for trade. No, we want to see what we get here. Okay, and whether if I remove everything. How are we looking at this? Whether we can put this one in relative to each other for flat for continuation, or we can expect the price to drop quite more. Okay, by the way, right now we have nothing. The only, we, I mean, since the price also broke this low, the only thing is we need to wait quite time based on forward chart to see what we will get from here. Whether this is the only correction for next move, or still we can expect the price to drop a bit more. Okay, that means still the possibility of this one can continue is there. Anyway, based on forward chart, we don't have any trade setup. And even we can see if we put the trend line, we have the breakout of the trend line. May this one give us a correction for one more drop. Okay, in this case, we move to one hour chart. Now, as I mentioned, anyone is in the trade, they should start to protect the trade. If they wanna keep the trade, manage the trade. And if you put, we wanna see whether we have divergence, Based on one hour chart, we can, I mean, make the, we have it and as well here. Okay. Now the thing says, we don't have any buy setup because if we want to look for buy setup, we need to get a reversal. But right now we expect, still expecting the price to give us one more drop. Okay. If this is the only correction, the only way to have entry below this, which is really risky, depends on the traders. But if this one turned to a deeper corrections, at least similar to what we have here, or at least it give us three waves, then the next move also we can look for because we can put these two in relative to each other for one more drop. Anyway, no we wanna see whether we can get one more sell or not, we're looking for. And the only thing is what I need to highlight here that from now, if you any, if you get any sell, we consider it as a short term sell. As long as we get into the profit, we start to manage it. In case there is a reversal because we point that maybe this one we can put in relative to each other. Okay, and we don't have any buy setup Okay, unless we get a really sharp move with the flag with the breakout of this. Okay, by the way, we just follow the chart. We see whether we can get one more drop. And after that, I mean, we need to wait for the quiet times. I mean, a few hours or maybe half a day. Then we, from there, we want to see how we can look for this. And what's the next in the long term. Okay, anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.